There are Kai MPC Studio instructional DVDs. They're on sale now. Just click here. It takes you right to the page. You can get the DVDs or the download. Check out this video preview. Check this out. This is classic Dre bass. That's right. That's on my MPC Studio. I'm going to show you how we did that. Watch. I'm going to show you how we can make this really classic, great Moog bass, like a Dr. Dre bass, or even a great reggae bass. Now, here we've got this Moog, mini Moog set you see right here. This is from our own collection that we saw at SampleKings.com from our MPC full collection. Now, I open this up, and I loaded in these samples you see right here. Okay? You got to load already. So, I've got a brand new sequence. And I've got no program here, so what I'm going to do is go right here to where it says Program Edit, and we're going to go to Program Edit. Next, I want to make a brand new program. I'm going to go right down here. Those are all the programs I have in here so far, but I want to make a new one. So I go to Add Program. Here's Add Program. I click here. I say, look, I want to make a new base. I put down New. I go B-A-S-S. I want to have a new base. Next, I want to make it a key group. Bam. Key group. I press OK. And now the keys are on the left hand side right here, right? Now, I need to select a layer. I go to here. I'm going to scroll down and I'm looking for Moog. That's all I'm looking for, babies. Just Moog. Here you go. We got Moog. There's Moog. That's the note, a C note. Now notice, it's right here, zero for the tuning of semitones. We got fine, zero, full level, pan. This is just the way it is. And our velocity. No matter how we hit it, it's always going to play that one note. It's going to play across the entire keyboard. And our keyboard ranges from C minus 2, C minus 8, all the way up. Next, we're going to select another note. Now, I want to get one more Moog bass note to go in here. So let me scroll down here and find that note I want to get. It's going to be Moog 3. And it should be 3CO. Okay, here we go. 3CO. Sounds like some sort of Star Trek doll. But here we go, right. So now I've got these sounds. I'm going to turn one sound down and hit a pad. I'm going to write where I want to have the pads at. I want to select full level so I make sure. That's yeah, better. All right, perfect. Now you can also adjust the space. This is kind of cool. So, of course, we see it's going to go from minus C to 8, G, G8. So it's going to be 88 keys. All keys are going to play the same sound. I can go to here, for example. I can select maybe this 8-pole bypass filter. Now, play the sound. Oh, took it away, right? So, watch this. I'll pull this down to here. I get a reggae bass. Maybe go here to a high pass. So, we're letting the higher end of this note range go through. So there isn't much highs. There aren't that many highs in this Moog bass, but the highs that are there are sort of being boosted here. You can see that. And so I've got low pass and we've got this bypass and high pass filter. I got a low pass as well. That's pretty deep. And I can go back here again and let's say I want to keep that. And I can always change this keyboard settings. Let's say I get something here, and I want to try a different model here. Let's try something like an MPC Low Pass. And that's pretty deep.